right, Daddy Jack's going with the blues here. So, got my buddy here. Look at him now. Well, he's ready to go, isn't he? Dog day of early some early oh, nothing on that spoon. But uh as Daddy Jack's going with the blues, so got some beautiful bagels they make here locally, Deeks and Niantic. And uh so one thing I love, uh my buddy Bruno, um, you know, he worked we worked together since uh, Atlanta days, the Hyatt Regency in Atlanta. And uh but he, he's he, you know, we've we worked together, he came down to uh, Texas and worked Worked together down there. Then he's been up here in Connecticut working with me. He's back in England right now. But his deal was a uh, scooped bagel. And uh, so normally you get a bagel, you toast it. And uh, But he likes it scooped. So what you got to do is you got to take a spoon. See? It kind of. Give it a good scoop out. Now, 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 bagel shops hate to do it. I guess it's big in New York. Uh, that's it right there. Scooped. Okay. Put it on our toaster. Scoop the other side. So we're making a lobster. Making a scooped lobster salad sandwich. And you see it, it just, the whole bagel comes out toasted, just like the outside. I love it. My buddy Axel, he'll, he clean up some of the scraps. So uh, that goes down. And we'll be right back, clean this up a little bit. All right, so we got our lobster. They just, uh, we had a lobster feed uh, a few days ago with um, Mike Taylor down there. Uh, the Jeanette T fishing boat he gave me like three beautiful lobsters and i said i told him i said the best lobster meat i've ever i've ever had so uh, a lot of people you know a purist i just put a little bit of uh mayo some of the hearts of the celery a little bit of chopped onion that's it then i'm not going to put any I'm not going to put any mayo on the uh, on the on the uh, bagel, so a little bit, a little bit extra mayo in the mix. The best lobster lobster roll I ever had was at that. Uh, it's called uh, Ribbon Claw. It's down in uh, right on Pequot Avenue. They use fresh tarragon, but I'm going to put just a little bit of dried tarragon. A little bit of dried tarragon. So that's a summertime special up here. Lobster rolls and uh, sometimes hot or cold. Hot would be just with uh, melted butter. A lot of a lot of places use the uh, the uh, clarified butter, which has got no flavor. But I like just toss it with some melted butter, fresh melted butter. Okay. We'll be right back. It's one, we got to toast that up nice and crisp. It's getting there. All righty. There she is. Look at them. Oh, look at that goodness right there. Yep. So, this is what I like. This is my favorite lunch probably in the summer. Rainier, Rainier cherries. Now they're in season. The uh, We went to the shop right yesterday for the regular cherries. They are on sale. The Washington State for $1.99 sold out. But um, so, um, so I just put a little bit of mayo on the inside of the, the, uh, the roll. I said I wasn't going to, but put a little bit. You can butter, you can butter this if you want. And then uh, put it on our plate. And uh, 
as my grandma used to do, a little, little paprika. There's a little bit of paprika on top. And then the second one, do a little sweet and savory. So like dessert, all rolled in one. A nice cream cheese. Got one more spoon here. So this is some homemade strawberry jam. The first strawberries of the season. So I had a little bit of, just a little bit of maple syrup left in a maple syrup jar. A Vermont maple syrup. Look at it. So I just cook it down a little bit more sugar. Strawberries. Easy to make your own jelly at home. You know, instead of buying, we don't know what's in it here. But that's it. If I had a little bit of uh, greenery, a little bit of green onion may be nice on there. But that's it right here. Beautiful lunch. No oil and vinegar. Maybe I'll crack a little bit of uh, Himalayan salt over the top. Squeeze a little bit of lemon on top. If you want a little bit on your lobster salad. That's a beautiful summer lunch here up in New England. Hey, Jack's cooking with the blues. We got lobster salad on a, a scooped, scooped lobster salad. Uh, a little bit of strawberry, fresh strawberry jam with cream cheese. Rainier cherries, Rainier cherries. A little bit of tomato, a little bib lettuce, pepperoncini, lemon. That's it. You want a little glass of wine or something with it? Uh, check out. Deke's Bagels, if you're ever up in the area, come through here. Deke's Bagels over in Niantic. Deke is like, he sells them as fast as he can make them. They're lined up out the door. Mike Taylor, uh, he's on uh, Chef Mike, I believe it is, on uh, Instagram. So scallops and lobsters right off the boat, same day. He goes out, catches them. Uh, the scallops goes out at 4 o'clock in the morning, comes back by 2 in the afternoon and sets up his daughters, Emma and Maria, helping them out. His wife, you know, she's, uh, they're, the whole family's involved. But anyway, Daddy Jack's going with the blues. Axel. Oh, and he's, come here, come here. You wiped out, buddy, huh? Yeah. They all want, they all, everybody's asking to see Axel. He's been with these warm days. He's kind of just chilling out. But, uh, Daddy Jack's going with the blues. Check us out on Patreon. Uh, we're uploading a lot of, uh, we're going to start doing some live, uh, cooking with the Blues, uh, YouTube Live, but uh, only uh, interact. You can interact with us. Become a member of uh, on Patreon. It's uh, patreon.com slash cooking with the Blues. You can sign up anywhere from a dollar a month to whatever you're, you're, you're feeling. And uh, we have uh, some uh, some music we're producing at Daddy Jack's. It's going to be exclusive to Patreon. Uh, my audio blog for my cookbook. I, I'm, I'm doing... Uh, readings from that and uh there'll be uh, some other memorabilia coming up uh that are available for purchase and and uh, and all that but here day jacks color blues peace <laughs>